very important question because it's the last command that was given to us by the Lord Jesus. He said, go into all the world, that all power is given to me in heaven and earth, go into all the world and make disciples. So the question is, how do you know when you've made a disciple? Standards will be understood. And that's what we want to be able to have. Standards in music, standards in our daily life, standards in, in all these areas of being here this week is knowing beyond a shadow of a doubt that we have for every one of you the answer. IBLP. IBLP. IBLP had not equipped me to be a functioning adult in the world. So the first thing I'll, I'll say about that is, for me personally, I ended up in counseling for clinical depression when I was a young adult. That I was sheltered. I was not encouraged to be sociable with anybody outside of our church, which was very small. I was ill-prepared for the real world. IBLP, the Institute in Basic, Li Basic Life Principles. So it's an entire, it was an entire movement started by Bill Gothard. We were never members. We were never deeply ingrained in the program. We never did any of the curriculum. Any Michael, before we get started, I do just want to say thank you so much for letting me be a part of you breaking your silence and sharing your story with the world and really exposing what it was like not only growing up in IBLP, but growing up in the Bard family cult as well. I can't honestly say that I had planned out or intentions of really sharing, but my mom being my mom just kept poking me and poking me and poking me. And, you know, it was one of those things where it was one too many pokes and I just kind of lost it. And I was like, all right, well, gloves are off. Here we go. There wasn't really any other way I could think of to get them to pay attention other than kind of hit them, you know, the only place they care about, which is their social media. 